As a makeup artist, I know that every single person has different demands. I have clientele ranging from 20 up to 60 plus, and every skin type um, requires different attention. Um, I want to talk to you a little bit about what happens when our skin changes, and here are a few makeup tips that you can utilize to really make your makeup still look age appropriate and beautiful. Now, Shayna obviously doesn't have problems yet, but maybe in 10, 15, 30 years, she might encounter a little bit of dryness, especially around her orbital bone area, um, around the lips, and um, around the nostrils. Now, um, it is really, really, really important that as we're getting older, we start moisturizing much more, and um, in doing so, we are also uh, retaining um, the skin's elasticity. Before you apply your makeup, you really want to make sure your skin is well moisturized. Um, you can also use a primer that contains a little bit of silicone that will actually fill in fine lines um, and fill in pores. Stay away from products that contain too much shimmer or highlighters because that can only or will only accentuate um, unwanted areas, especially around the eye areas. That's where actually most of my more mature clientele tends to get a little bit drier. Um, so really be careful with highlights and shimmers. Um, you really want to see if you can find a product that um, is plumping as well as moisturizing. And the thing that I can only stress the most is to find a foundation that contains um, sunblock or sunscreen. Um, that is, the sun is the number one aging factor and this is definitely something that is very, very easy if it is already in your foundation to just put that on in the morning.